Welcome back, everybody, to Seven Days to Die Undead Legacy. I'm an old guy gaming, and in this episode, we're going to see if we can make a motorcycle. I haven't actually uh, confirmed that I can, but we're going to try it. And I figured, well, let's try it on camera. Uh, so I brought everything back from the wasteland. It took me a couple of trips uh, to do that. And um, for the reward, I, I did get that on camera. Uh, but I decided not to show it because it is this titanium club. It's a it's an F level titanium club. It is not as good as our sledgehammer because it's a one handed weapon. Though it's probably a pretty good one handed club, and that's what we got. So, um, yeah. So we got that done. Uh, we do have another point to spend. Let's take a quick look at that. So I think we're gonna put this point into. Uh, I want to do Penetrator, and I want to do Lucky Looter as we continue work on Deadeye and Archery. So, you know what? Let's do Archery first. Let's favor Archery first, and then we'll be working on those other ones. Okay, so that takes care of that point, and that was a loud thunderclap. Uh, so, if you didn't see the last episode, or maybe the one before that, I think it might have been the one before that, we found ourselves a motorcycle engine, finally. So, I have that here. And uh, so what we're going to do is see what we need to do to make the motorcycle. Um, and no, I don't want the ballistics table. So let's go ahead and do, do, do. Wait, wait, where's my... Oh, mechanics bench is over here. Yeah. Mechanics table's here. Okay, so uh, we're talking about the wanderer here. And I, we have the knowledge to make the chassis and the handlebars. What we don't have is the steel plating. We need a total of 30 steel plating. Um, the other thing I wanted to, to... I really want is this vehicle cargo extension, but there's no... Uh, did we look at this earlier? I can't remember. Let, let, let's go here. So let's go cargo. Yeah, see, there's no schematic for it. So I guess we... I don't know how we learn this. I guess, <clears throat> excuse me. I guess we just find... We have to find the schematic in the world. We can't make the schematic itself. So that really makes the vehicles uh, quite a bit less useful than they are in, in vanilla because it has zero storage in them, but they're still useful, of course. So, okay, well... Um, our stopping point definitely then is going to be steel on the motorcycle, but why don't I keep going back over that way? But if that's the only thing that's stopping us, we could still potentially make it. Okay, so we don't know how to make a motorcycle wheel, so we'd have to research that. Um, to make those, we got the engines, we got the batteries. The rest of this stuff is easy peasy, and that's all pretty easy peasy too. Okay, so let's see. What do we need to research the motorcycle wheels? Uh, this guy here. Okay, so we need all of this stuff. So let's pin this. I think I have all of that. I should have all of that. So we need 20 of these. I'm, I've got to go do some more mining too. Uh, definitely have to do some mining. We need five bearings. So we got that. Uh, we need a hundred scrap rubber. We have a thousand. Actually, we have more than a thousand. So let's get a hundred of those. Okay. We need five adhesive. And we need a 400 research. I'm just going to grab all of those and 400 or uh, 10 paper. Okay, let's get uh, to researching this. That'll be done in in 59 seconds, 58 seconds. Put the research points back in there, put these back in here. Okay, so we'll be able to make the motorcycle wheel. So what we basically need to do is we need steel. So, I guess, let's see, lamp posts, vending machines, uh, that sort of thing. We got a lot of lamp posts around here. So, yeah, we're going to go hit some lamp posts. Let's get a few more frames because we're just going to nerd pull to get those. Now, we currently have four, yeah, we have four steel. So, we, in effect, have almost nothing at all. What did I do with my extra frames that I made? Oh, we got a bunch of stuff to sell, too. Yeah, that's right. We do. Um, I had a bunch of extra frames. What did I do with them? 
Frames, frames, where's the frames? We didn't put them in there, we didn't put them in there, we didn't put them in there. Wouldn't make sense to put them in there. Oh, you know what? Did I not make frames? <laughs> Excuse me, cause zone tight! Yeah, you know what? I don't think I did make some frames. I was thinking about making frames. But let's actually make them now. So, let's see how many- Oh no, I did! They're right here. Never mind. Okay. I'm losing my mind! You guys are saying, what else is new? So what else is new? Okay, so we do have some frames here. Um, let's just, I don't know, let's carry 20. We gotta be careful. We don't wanna carry too much of that kind of stuff because it just makes us all that much heavier. All right, so yeah, I think steel is the name of the game. We gotta get steel, but let's also sell. So I've got all the stuff in there to sell and all of this stuff to sell too. Um, boy, the thing is, though, is I don't know if I have enough resources to repair all this stuff, and we really should to get maximum bank. So I'll tell you what we're going to do. Let's grab stuff that's already fully repaired or doesn't need to be repaired. That doesn't go in there. This goes up here. And we'll sell that, and then I'm, I'm going to have to do some off-camera mining. And uh, we will... You know, I'll have to get some resources to repair the rest of this stuff before we, we sell it. But if it doesn't need repairing, let's grab it now. Let's grab our, our coin, too. So all of this stuff needs repairing. Uh, however, that's scrap, so that can ease... And I think the frying pan... Well, here. Anything that's scrap, we have plenty of stuff to repair that. So we might as well do that, too. Is that scrap? No, that's actual iron... All right, so let's uh, repair those, uh, repair this. Oh, I guess that doesn't need to be repaired. Uh, yeah, okay, that's all that we need to do there. This is scrap. That's scrap. This is scrap. Oh, this is scrap. Those take pipes. These are going to take iron. You know what? We might actually have enough to do this. All right, well... That's not what I meant to do, damn it. All right, put all this stuff back in here. Let's grab all of these. Oh, and let's grab some pipes, too. We're, like, super heavy. Can we walk at all? Oh, no, we can't. Okay. Let's put half of those back. Can we... We still can't walk. Okay, what do, what do we have that's, like, the biggest, heaviest item here? Let's put that in there. Can I... Yeah, now I can move. Okay. Just want to, enough to get over here. Okay, so... Yeah, see, that's going to take five, though. Hmm. Let's repair that. Anything that's not going to take, like, more than, say, two-ish or so of iron... Oh, yeah, we need the scrap for that. Okay. That probably takes steel to repair, so we'll have to wait on that one. Anything else that requires pipes to repair? I don't think so. All right. You will only take three. We'll get a lot of money from you. That's all scrap. These guys are in good enough shape. I don't think we need to worry about it. You require three. Okay, we'll take that then. That's scrap. And, ah, uh, what the hell. Uh, we're, we don't have enough for that one. Okay, no problem. This will have to be sold next time. All of this stuff here will sell next time because we just don't have enough stuff to do it. All right, now let's put that in there. Let's grab a little bit of this scrap back out of here. Can we still move? Yeah. And we'll repair all the scrap stuff. Uh, so that's going to be you... And you. And you. And you. I think that gets us pretty good. Okay. Uh, this this we'll have to do next time too. Okay. Well, this will we'll make a little bit of bank off of this stuff. We already have seventy nine hundred and forty seven coin, even as it is. And it's probably going to be worth it for us to do a sugar butts also. I think there's enough stuff to warrant that. 
let's put this scrap back in here. Can we carry this and still walk? Yeah. We're a little bit heavy, but that's fine. Okay, so we're going to go over it. We're going to sell this stuff to the trader, make a little money, and then I'm going to go around town and wrench traffic lights. Um, I'll see if I can get enough in this town, enough steel in this town from traffic lights. If not, I'm going to have to head over to the wasteland uh, to get the rest of the steel. But we need a total of 30 steel to make those two motorcycle pieces. Oh my goodness, we're heavy. We probably should have sold to What's-His-Face instead. Doesn't matter, though. Let's close that door. A nickel ain't worth a dime anymore. I know it's not. It just isn't. Okay. Uh, here, let's do this first. We already have our, our cigar in our mouth, so we're good to go there. Okay. Um, let's start selling to you. So we're starting with 7947. Let's see what we have at the end. Okay, that's all he wants to buy. We are up to 13,027, uh, which is pretty good. I did look at his stash earlier. I mean, we have um, about half of what we need to just outright buy a motorcycle. Uh, but he doesn't really have anything all you're gonna buy. else that we I want. Show yourself out. I don't see anything in there. Whoop. I think I looked at Raiden's uh, inventory table. Let's just take a quick look at it again. All right. So does he have anything? What do you need? He's got a better compound bow, actually. Hmm. It's not super better. It's a little better. I don't know if it's worth spending fifty-six fifty on them because it's not super better, you know. Uh, it'd be nice to have an SMG. I've got over a full stack of ten mils that we've just accumulated over time. That would we could get that one for fifty-five twenty-five. These enforcer shotguns are they better than this? Uh, no, they're not. Because, wait, that does 124, this does 147 without mods. Yeah, okay, so those aren't any better. All right, secret stash. Do, 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 do. Nah, not really anything there we want either. Okay. Oh, actually, though, will you buy stuff that the other guy didn't buy? He will. Look at that. That's nice. Okay. Cool. And those tough guys. If you wish. I wish. All right, you guys. Well, I'm going to go around town, like I said, and uh, start wrenching traffic lights. And I might not bring you guys back until tomorrow morning uh, because it is getting late. I don't know if I can even wrench these. Let's see. Do I get a, a ping here if I try and hit this? Nope. Okay. I should be able to get these. So, yeah, I'm just going to go around town here tonight. Wrench traffic lights, and in, I'll bring you guys back in the morning, and we will uh, proceed then, hopefully, uh, to make our motorcycle. So I'll see you then. All right, guys, we are back, and last night I got uh, 59 steel plating, just going around hitting uh, the street lights and the transformers. And I uh, also went out and got some iron, and so we've got... Uh, iron plating cooking up in here and we may and I made the wheels last night too so we have the two motorcycle wheels there okay so the next step is to get the motorcycle chassis made so let's pin that and we're gonna need 25 of these guys whoops took one too many off we're gonna need 10 mechanicals let's grab those next we're going to need 10 duct tape. We're going to need three electrical parts. And we're going to need 10 hide. Yeah, I, I it was very difficult for me to do a whole lot of salvaging uh, after nightfall because, you know, the zombies are all set on feral scents and they just 
wouldn't stop coming after me, man. All right, so we can now make this. Next, we want to make the handlebars, so let's pin that. Uh, we're going to need five steel. We're going to need ten pipes. Two springs. Ten mechanicals. Uh, six electricals. Ten duct tape. And one headlight. And that allows us to then make the handlebars. Okay, so we got about three, about four-ish minutes before those are all done. And then once those are done, uh, then we have the motorcycle itself. So we have the engine here. And we'll just put that right down in here so it's ready to go. Uh, and we're going to need a battery too. So let's just take the crappiest battery we have because it doesn't matter. And we'll put that down there. And yeah, when these pieces are done, then we'll be ready to make our motorcycle. And it's going to be awesome. All right, while we're waiting on that, let's get uh, this stuff out of here. And I want to finish repairing uh, the rest of the stuff that we want to sell. So we'll hit that. Uh, this is going to take three steel. So we still have 29 left over from the night's uh, salvaging efforts. Okay, that should be just one thingy of iron. That this will be uh, one thingy of iron. This will be three thingies of iron. Two thingies. And what do you want? You want one steel. Uh, okay, whatever. It's probably not worth it, but we'll do it anyway. Nope, not you. You. See, right now this is only worth 91. If we repair it, it's now worth 168. Yeah, I guess that was probably worth one thing of steel, I guess. I guess, I guess. And yeah, we'll get that repaired too. Okay, so all the stuff we can sell now and make a little bit more bank. Let's put the rest of the iron back. And we're going to put you in here. And we're going to put you in here. And we're going to put half of you in here. Like so. All right. Let's uh, let's let's run over to the trader. Well, actually, no. I'm going to wait for this to finish because the motorcycle itself is probably going to take a little bit of time, too. So let's just wait for this to finish. We'll get the motorcycle itself cooking up. Then we'll run over the trader, sell the stuff, and then come back, get our motorcycle, and then see what our next maneuver is going to be. You know, um, I think the next thing I want to do is the Blacksmith's Forge Tier 2. Uh, because then we can make bobby pins, and then then we'll pretty much have an unlimited supply of bobby pins, amongst other things, right? Uh, we're also going to want to make the furnace, um, but I think let's do the forge first. I should have all of this stuff. That's not super terribly expensive for us to handle. Okay, so let's grab the stuff out of here. 50 brick, uh, 200 scrap iron. Wow, that's uh, almost all of our scrap iron, huh? We need to make a bucket. So uh, let's make that first. Okay, so we'll craft the bucket. All right, what else? Um, you're going to need 20 clay. That's easy peasy. And 400 research data. Just throw all of that in there. And 10 paper. We'll just throw that in there. Our bucket needs water in it, so we'll go over to our well here, here and fill that up. And then we need the 200 uh, scrap iron. So let's grab that. Okay, we should be able to research 
uh, the tier two blacksmith forge. Let's do that right now. And now we should be able to make the motorcycle. Put the stuff back in here. Did I grab, I must've grabbed more bricks than I needed to. Okay, so I'll grab all these parts here. And there we go. Two minutes, two and a half minutes. <coughs> Gazoon tight. <laughs> Uh, two and a half minutes. We'll have a motorcycle, ladies and gentlemen. Yay! We need gas, though. We really need gas. Um, I was looking at the gas can schematic, and it is not cheap. It is not cheap at all. Um, <coughs> excuse me, man. That nose is bothering the hell out of me. Uh, it's right here. Okay, so it's five acid, and I don't think we have a beaker, and it's 2,000 research data. Oh, my goodness. That's expensive. Yeah, we don't even have enough research data now. Uh, we do have enough acid, so we got that covered. Uh, beaker. If I had a beaker, it would be in here. I don't. So we're going to have to be on the lookout for a beaker. Maybe buy it from the trader if we find one for sale. Um, or, you know, of course, loot one. That's always the best way to do it. Um, Blacksmith's Forge Tier 2. Wait a minute. Are you telling me I already know this? I already know this. What? We just wasted all those materials on something I already know? Oh, that was dumb. All right, well, shit. Oh, no, you guys. We just wasted 350 research points and other material. That sucks. All right, why why didn't I make that? It's, I'll bet you it's because we probably need the Tier 2 workstation. Um, Let's see, Blacksmith's Forge Tier 2. No, we need a Tier 2 Artisan's Table to make that. Oh, okay, so... What do we need to make the artisans then? Okay. Artisans table tier two. We need all of this stuff. Oh, that's a shame that I wasted all those points. It really is, but son of a bitch, man. Okay. Well, all right. Let's, uh, how, how close are you? You're 30 seconds out. Let's get the motorcycle done first. We'll go over to the trader, sell this stuff, and then we'll come back and see if we can put together all the stuff that we need for the artisan's table so that we can then make the blacksmith's forge. Ah, what a what a pain in the butt, man, that we lost all those research points. Oh, well, what can you do, right? What can you do but just keep on, keep it on? Let's put you in here. And um, I'm going to... I'm going to take another sugar butts for this sale because, or for these sales, because we'll make a decent amount of coin off of this stuff. There we go. There's our motorcycle. It's interesting that the motorcycle has a level. So it's, it's actually a level four. Does it have storage? Oh, it does, you guys. Oh, yes. I thought I was going to have to put a storage mod on this. This is amazing. Okay, that's going to help so much. That's going to help. Oh, we got a wandering horde coming there. That's going to help a ton. All right, let's uh, fuel it up. Yep, that completely fueled it up. Okay. Uh, they don't even see me. How funny is that? Okay, nobody make a noise. They don't even see me. I thought for sure that cop was going to spot us. Okay. Oh, this is great, man. Now, we only, we're only we limited to 500 pounds of weight, though, but still, that's that's amazing. I have to say, that is just freaking amazing. All right, so that used up a full tank of gas. Um, I think this was full. So, yeah, I think the motorcycle requires a full tank. Uh, why don't we go back up here for a minute and... Refill you up. So I've got almost a full barrel here. So we don't have a ton of gas. We are going to have to be somewhat frugal uh, when it comes to that. But anyway, look at us. Yes. Oh, man, this thing's so much faster than the mini bike, too. I love it. Oh, you know what? We've got a turbo thingy and a fuel saver mod on the mini bike that we should take off and put on here. We will definitely do that. Okay. 
Oh, I hate this door. This takes so damn long. All right, Trader hey, Hugh. Quick about your business. Let's take one of these. We're at, we have 13,391 coin at the moment. Um, let's take a look at your inventory and see what we can make here. Now we're up to 16,748. Not too bad. Now let's take, see what he has. He's got an impact driver. How much does that cost? 1,800. Uh. Maybe. Let's keep that in mind. Let's keep that in mind. Let's see what else we got. That's a sofa. Wood splitter mod. Okay, what's he got in secret? Uh, that, 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 that. Okay. This is tempting. We're going to want one of these, but we also need one of these to make, I think it's the tier three, either carpenter bench or, or, or a workbench. So, yeah, let's keep that in mind. I, I don't think I want to buy it quite just yet. I guess you're not so bad after I'm all. I'm not so bad after all, man. I keep telling you that. Let's buy that. Uh, we already have two eye candies. I need to actually remember to use the eye candies. We should be using those on the tier four loot. All right, what do you have, man? Okay. Not really anything too phantasmagorical there. He's got a, a chili dog um, schematic. How much does that cost? 1800 Hmm. Yeah, not... Uh, can't say that I'm super excited about any of this stuff that these guys have. Okay, well, let's go back and get that, that turbo mod and the... Or no, the fuel saver mod. I don't think I have a turbo mod, actually. That stupid horde's still around, too. All right, so let's look under the hood here. Yeah, we got a fuel saver mod. Okay, well, that will definitely help. So we'll put this on you. Okay. Nice. All right, we have ourselves a motorcycle, ladies and gentlemen. A motorcycle. You are almost full, so we want to make sure you stay that way uh, so we can use you as a backup. And let's just park the bike right there. Get it out of the way. We'll park you right here. There we go. All right. Nifty nifty. So, um, what is the next step? Let's take these bastards out. We need to practice our sniping anyway. Right, we got the attention of two of you. Miss sucker. Okay. You're next. Your sledgehammer has improved to 47. All right, nice. Let's bring him over here. Oh right, we were gonna we were gonna look into making the artisan's table too. Wow, we just about killed him. Really close. We just have really low skill right now in rifles is all. There we go. Okay. I think there was a couple more, wasn't there? Got a soldier Zeke over there. Did that even hit him? Well, look at you. There's somebody over there that's all agitated as well. I don't think I don't think we can shoot through that. It's not doesn't seem to be doing any damage to him. <laughs> okay. We 
Will you die, please? Does it have any fuel in it? It doesn't, no. <laughs> well, that takes care of him. That takes care of him. Uh, all right. I don't see any more of those uh, hordies around. So let's go ahead and head back and see if we can get this Artisan's 2 table made so we can get that Blacksmith Station made. Tier 2. All right, so what do we need for the artisans? Let's pin this. Um, <clears throat> we're going to need 25 of these. Here, let's put this in here and that in there for the moment. So I think we're going to have to pull paper back out. We need 80 iron rebar. I only have 40, but I think we can... What do we need to make those? Ah, uh, we don't have any more iron ingots, do we? Uh, I, well, I have these. It takes... Is this a one-per-one one thing? Let's see. Yeah. All right. Nope, I don't quite have enough. We're going to have to go... Do some more iron mining and or salvaging to get enough of those. Okay, so that's not going to work right now. That's something I'll have to do later on. Excuse me. So, um, let's see. What should we do for the rest of this episode? I'm not even sure how much time's gone by yet. I've kind of lost track. Yeah, you know, we're probably actually about at, at the time limit here. I think we are. So, even if we're not, I think we're going to wrap it up here because this is a good stopping point for us. So, uh, let's see. It is day 41. Horde is tomorrow. So, you know, I probably am going to take some of my cash. You know what we really freaking need is a cement mixer. But to get the cement mixer, we need the workstation level 2. And to get the workstation level 2, we need a ratchet, which I don't have. Um, I don't think the traders were selling that. I probably would have picked up on it. But maybe they were. Do I still have my money with me? I do. But if that's, you know, if we can't do that, we're going to have to buy a pretty, you know, significant chunk of concrete mix for for the next Horde Night. Uh, I'm planning on using the same base again, the one we've been using down there, but we just got to get it reinforced to concrete because, you know, these Hordes are going to get nastier and nastier. Let's pop back in here again for a second. And, oh, we got the little graphics glitch thing. I want to see if he actually has any concrete. We could go. I could go check the other traders Everything too if they don't. Is for sale. Now, any chance you have a ratchet, by the way? I. You know what we should do is we should go on a road trip with a motorcycle and check all the traders, because they might have ratchets for sale. Um. But you do not. Okay, so you don't have any ratchets. Do you have concrete? Oh, do you even have concrete mix? Oh, he doesn't even have concrete mix. Seriously, dude? Really? Nope, he doesn't. Daylight's burning. Yeah, right. Okay, well, yeah, we're probably have to do a road trip, guys. Uh, in the next episode, go hit all of the traders that we've currently uncovered. Well, I'm looking for concrete and or a ratchet or a ratchet schematic. Um... If we got a ratchet schematic, I'll bet you we still need a, uh, no, we can make that in the normal workbench. Oh, actually, hold on a sec. We might be able to do this after all. Okay. We're going a little longer after all. That's right. We might be able to do this after all. I was thinking we needed a tier two workbench for that. How much steel do I have left? I have 25. Okay, here, let's do this. Let's go over here. And we want to do ratchet. Okay, let's pin that. Okay, it's going to use up all the rest of our steel, but uh, I'm probably going to have to go back to the wasteland and, and get more steel because I'm sure we're going to need steel to make the ratchet. But if we can at least get 
Well, okay, let me think about this. Should we go check the traders first before we spend all these resources on this? Uh, yeah, I think we should. Let's wait. Let's wait. Okay. So plan for tomorrow is for us to go hit the traders. We're looking for concrete mix and we're looking for a ratchet or a ratchet schematic. Uh, so that we can make the tier two workbench so that we can then make the concrete mixer. And you know how it is. You know, one thing leads to another in this mod. You got to have one thing before you can do the next thing. So anyway, I think I'm going to let you guys go here. Hope you guys enjoyed the episode. If you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment and share the video. And we'll catch you in the next episode. Bye-bye.